thank you very much for, for, for this, for giving me this. And I appreciate my fans also. My wife and my girlfriend. I mean my wife, yeah, sorry to say. I'm so I'm so sorry, my wife. Lizzo, I love you so much. Aya, I love you so much from my heart. Ne? So you must keep on supporting me. And thanks for, for to come to the game. Let's take a look at birthdays and anniversaries in the meantime. Happy 80th birthday to E. Norma Stitz of Quitman. Happy birthday to you, Miss E. Norma. Hope you have a wonderful day. You know, I was watching an episode of uh, You where measles came up. Wait, wait, wait. When did I mention measles? I don't know. It was on you. What, 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 what was on me? What are you talking about? Right? What is the, the measles hearing what I'm the saying? I never had the measles. What's on you? We never did a, a we never did a measles and vaccine episode. Am I, is this a joke? I, know. I don't even know it, what you're talking about. It was on you. It was on you. I've never had Raymond. I've never had measles. What are you talking about? This is stupid. It was an episode of a show, Laura. Well, what's it called? You. What is you. Called? It's called you. I've never done a show on measles. I, I just completely give up. We got to get it's out of It's a show I, I give up. called you on Netflix. There's a show called Loring on Netflix. What are you never talking mind. about? I'm moving on to Adele. I can't explain this to you. And if you're making last minute dinner plans, you may have a hard time getting in some of the titties in some, in some of the city's top spots. Name something you might hurt yourself riding on. Oh, Lord. You know what I'm thinking? Uh, you know what I'm thinking? A penis. <laughs> Shut up! Nasty ass audience. It's things you can say to your dog, but not your girlfriend. <laughs> Come. This is you as an all-American and a big opportunity for you in Hollywood. You must have had to beat off a lot of American men to get this part. <laughs> <laughs> Why does that make you giggle? Did you not have to beat them off? You had to, to get stick? the role. There was, imagine there was quite Sorry. a few men up for the role as well. Is there were. There, there were. Um... <laughs> and compose yourself. This is a question for both McGregor and uh, Cowboy. I see you both winning the championship coming up soon. Could you see yourself fighting each other coming up in the next year? Yeah, go ahead, McNugget. You want to answer that or no? Ladies first. <laughs> Did a good job of him, big shots. And then on, on the other end, we got some stops. Our, our D was good tonight. So we got to make sure our D stay good. Before the game, Ken Bazemore told me it's too far into the season to allow two losses back to back. If you agree with that, how important is that win? Oh, it's very important, but it starts with the D. So we got we got to make sure we keep playing defense. <laughs> Thank you, Dwight. A lot of Bays gazes. We'll let you go. Back to you guys. A 71-year-old man is accused of inappropriately touching a 12-year-old girl at the Walmart in West Mifflin Sunday afternoon. Uh, ninth anniversary and Hugh Janus turning 10. We had mentioned... <laughs> I'm sorry. What? what? I'm sorry. It's, it's one of those... It's one of those... <laughs> oh, I, I totally felt for it, didn't I? Jacqueline Jewett. Julie Jerkoff, forgive me, Kirkoff. Well, the sign says that it's four quarters for an hour, but a quarter only gets you 15 minutes. Yeah. So if my math is correct, that's not an hour. That's not an hour, not an but hour. it is. <laughs> and also... A quarter to <gasps> 15 minutes? <laughs> Rewind. Take that off. Take that off. You're right, 15 minutes is a quarter. I swear to God, I do not do drugs. I have not had liquor. My friends are leaving me. Well, anyways, we're doing a story about they want to change Please the Please don't put meter. that on. Pickup lines in space. Have you ever been in a black hole? <laughs> not even light can escape. <laughs> How about a swim in the Milky Way? And I mean, I had like 
I had unlimited like service after that. I was getting drinks and I was getting <laughs> snacks and I mean I was taking photos in the back with all the all the students. It was fun. Wait a minute, drinks? You're 19 years old. Yeah, I'm talking about Mountain Dews, baby. Uh <laughs> all right. <laughs> he called me baby. He <laughs> called me baby. Okay. Um, that's right. Ginger ale for Sean White. Outstanding. Um, okay, getting a little warm here. Um, Joining me now, former Arkansas Governor Mike Huckabee, who's the host of, Fuck of Huckabee, right here on the Fox News Channel. He's also a former Republican president. <laughs> Crashed. It was a <laughs> no laughing matter. And no, it was not part of their act. The two elderly men crashed their minivan on their way to the local fair. The driver, 83-year-old James Billingsley, <laughs> a.k.a. Dimples the Clown, collided. <laughs> He missed the entrance, but when he tried to make a U-turn, he slammed right into an SUV. They're okay. Police say Dimples was wearing oversized clown shoes, but police say that they did not play a role in the crash. Fliegeleicht und Achtung, Wortspiel, bestechlich. A lot of kids, they cannot be out in these sub-zero wind chills. Megan, back uh, to you. All right, so if they're canceling the train, does that mean that you and I are having another night in bed together? <laughs> That's a long story. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> um, I have no words. Yeah. Except that we're going to be on YouTube in a few minutes. <laughs>